Hello everyone, I'm Jessie. Today I'm gonna introduce you the tilt pressure sensitivity function of VIKK drawing tablet. First of all, what is the tilt pressure sensitivity? It is a common function widely used in drawing, especially in coloring. In most of the drawing software such as Photoshop and Krita, you can choose a tilted pressure sensitive brush to color your gradient artwork. So, what is the actual performance of the tilt pressure sensitivity in the drawing software? I will choose a tilted pressure sensitive brush in Krita to show it. And I have now an A50 drawing tablet which has not been upgraded which means it has no tilt pressure sensitivity and I will draw with two different pen holding gestures and uh, you guys can see that no matter how I hold the pen the darker handwriting is always on the right side and now I'm gonna connect an upgraded A50 with tilt pressure sensitivity and still use the same gesture. And this time we can find that the color gradient direction will change with the direction of the brush tilt. So this is a tilt pressure sensitivity. Okay, and whether you need to upgrade the tilt pressure sensitivity or not, if you only use the tablet for online tutorial or lessons, or taking notes, office work, and also playing games, this basically not need to use the tilt pressure sensitivity, which means you don't need to upgrade the tablet. But if you are an artist or a professional designer, it is very necessary for you to paint and color when you start to draw, then don't hesitate to upgrade your tablet. So which model can currently support the tilt pressure sensitivity? Now except for A30 drawing tablet, other models A640, A50, A15, A15 Pro need to contact our online customer service for firmware upgrade to achieve the tilt pressure sensitivity. The rest of models VK640, VK1060 Pro, VK1560 Pro, and VK1200 can directly support the tilt pressure sensitivity. Okay, finally, the most important part. Let me teach you how to upgrade the drawing tablet. The first step, because the Upgrade program cannot support the Mac system, so please find a Windows computer or laptop to upgrade. And make sure the Windows computer or laptop is directly connected with your tablet. If there is an adapter between them, it will fail to upgrade and cause the damage of your tablet. The second step, please download and install the latest new driver from our official website www.vikk.com And after installation, the upgrade tool will pop up. Then please close it to install so you can close it. And the third step, go to Google Drive to download the firmware of your tablet. The URL is in the description box below the video. The first step, make sure that your tablet is connected directly with your computer. And then open the driver program. Click About Us option. Then upgrade the firmware. Select the firmware corresponding to your drawing tablet model. And click OK to start the upgrade. And pay attention. If the upgrade fails, 
during the process. Please click upgrade again. Please do not unplug the tablet or close the program. Otherwise, the tablet will be directly damaged and the damage will not be covered by the warranty. Finally, to avoid damaging your tablet, I suggest you contact online customer service and upgrade the tablet under their guidance. Okay, that's all today's introduction. I'm Jesse, and please follow us for the latest information of VIKK. And if you have any questions, please contact the email below. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.